We have Grandmaster Kartikeyan Murli with us. Uh, he scored eight out of uh, nine and finished third. Congratulations, Kartikeyan. Thank you. Thank you. How was the tournament? The tournament was fantastic. Uh, it was organized by Rotary Club. Uh, they have stepped into chess, I think, for the first time. I don't know whether they have conducted any tournaments. Uh, the organization was excellent. They understood uh, the, uh, I don't know, like, how to say. They understood what uh, the players need. I mean, like, the, let's say, the tournament hall and also the waiting area for the spectators. Everything was fantastic. They, are, they, they have organized it perfectly. And uh, though there, there are some ch uh, corrections needed, but for the first time, uh, I think this is perfectly organized for being the first time. Generally, we do not get to see you in open tournaments or in Chennai. So, what made you choose this event? I don't know. It's like, okay, uh, it's been a while since I played rapid. So, I thought, okay, maybe I'll just, you know, like uh, play rapid, some rapid games. Which one was your best game from this event? Uh, I played with uh, Sai Agni Jeevitesh. We played a rook ending. That was like interesting rook ending. So I will say that was my favorite game. So would you say that a knight c6 against him was your best move of this event? No, actually knight c6 was a mistake. I think knight c6 is a mistake because he could have just played b into c6. And after d6 check there was knight b3. Rook d8 checking of son a b3 of g5. And uh, he is uh, getting two pieces for a uh, rook. Actually I missed just missed knight into b3 after b6 d6. But okay. Uh, it's it's rapid, so it's easy to miss stuff. In rapid chess. Uh, against uh, Peter Anand, the the knight ending. Uh, well, uh, did you realize that at some point uh, King e5 was uh, better that uh, better than King d6? No, actually, uh, even before that, uh, I think I had a clear way to win, which was when I played knight e8 check. He played King b7. Here, I actually missed the intermiss of King e4 because like. I it was just, I was thinking like I have to go towards the pawns but I I didn't think of like retreating. You know always the backwards moves are the toughest so so I like I just missed the intermiss and after that things were getting narrow like once you missed a, miss a clear win the advantage becomes less and uh, then you have to find some accurate moves to keep that advantage. So it's better to you know win clearly before itself than to you know like win uh, with uh, win with some like. Now it, it's now it's better to win clearly before than to like uh, uh, struggle and win later. So I think I struggled with by playing this is there. Yeah. What's next for you? Uh, I I'm going to BL BL Masters and then I'm playing Blissing and Open in Netherlands and then I'm going to Abu Dhabi. So I'm playing three tournaments in a row. Thank you very much, Kartikian, for your valuable time. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors. Thank you. Thank you.